Okay, YouTube, I'm going to try and do this on my phone. Um, bear with me, please. Uh, so, here is my, my knife collection. Uh, um, down there, you can barely see it in black, is the Kershaw uh, Volt 2, I believe. Uh, next to that is a nondescript Buck and Bear. Next to that is the uh, Quite Care quite carry strand uh next is the Astro spiro of course uh next to that is a uh automatic mom got in italy or one of in one of her travels there uh next to that is a Boker, um, collaborated with somebody, I can't remember, um, and next to that is, is my Buck 110 with a pocket clip that I put on there, um, I'm gonna try to pull some of these out. Next to that is a Kershaw uh, Fatback. I got it from Jimmy Slash quite a while ago now. Um, next to that is a um, Fudge, what is that? I can't remember what that is. I can't remember what that is. <laughs> um. Yeah, guys, if you, know, if you know that knife, remind me. I, I apologize. I, I can't remember the name of some of these that I've had for a while. Uh, next to that is a less expensive version of a buck my dad get, gave me uh, years ago. Um, I can't remember the model name. It's supposed to be... Um, and. Next, next to that is the Sog Zilla. Now, th these this won't include the the ones that don't have um, pocket clips, like the Rough Rider I I, I won from Big Red EDC, and the Rough Rider Tadpole, and some um, unnamed. Tiny buck that I can't remember the name of, uh, but I have those in a separate drawer. Uh, after the Sogzilla, they're all my Spydercos. Uh, down there was the Spyderco Reliance, uh, then the Spyderco Tenacious, then the, the blacked out uh, pair of three. Recently sent to me by Notorious EDC, Tom, down there, was gener ge generous enough to send that. Um, um, this is a Batman labeled flipper knife that someone sent me. A while ago that isn't on YouTube anymore uh, and I apologize guys if I spent too much time on, on all these maps this video would take forever um, here's the um, every, everyone knows this the code for from Co Co cold steel um, after that is the French made Reptilian I won from Zach stuff a little while ago um,
After that is a CRKT um, Biffle or something. No, that's uh, here's the uh, CVV riffle I won from JB or Big Red DC a while ago. I can't remember the name of that TRKT. Uh, like I said, guys, I can't remember the names of some of these. Uh, I apologize. apologize. Uh, after that is the uh, Lansky World Legal Knife, and I'm using quotation marks there. Uh, sent to me by uh, Flint and Steel Survival. Uh, after that is a uh, Smith and Wesson Karambit. Um, uh, the Cedar KT Pillar and a Knife, I can't remember the brand of, but I know Flint and Steel sent it a while ago. He sent it to me after my, my dad died. Uh, it was very nice to, of him. And behind that flap over there, see if I can do that without... Is the automatic... Uh, or, or the... The, the out the front that um fudge now I can't remember who sent that I I, I apologize um the out the front that a, a subscriber uh, recently sent me um this is what what happens when I'm I'm trying to Film and think at the same time. Uh, on this little tray uh, were a couple of my grandfather's knives. Um, uh, he worked at the Pentagon, so um, if you can see there, that's the White House and. There was another one of his, I don't know where he got that, and I'm pretty sure the uh, little sack was his, and the tray was his too. Uh, the, the toothpick, mom got me on one of her, in one of her travels. Um, I just keep it there, and, and the tray was my grandfather's too. Um, so there's that um and really the queen or king of my collection is the kukri my opa gave me years ago i'm pretty sure i was 12 uh I, when i when i was younger my i wasn't allowed to handle this but, uh, m mom said I wasn't allowed to handle it without dad around. So that's the way, I, that's the way it was. And then years ago, um, dad took it off the shelf, handed it to me and said, here, this is yours. I was probably about 20. So, um, that's, that's the famed Uncle Cow Cookery. Um, I was told... And there's Mu Kang. Uh, I was told he got that um, during his ser service in the army during World War II, but I don't know whether this, uh, that's true or not. So um, that's Uncle Cow's knife collection, or most of them. Um, you, you guys know the ones I won that haven't been shown. So um, yeah, yeah, they, they stay in in. in in a little drawer thing on my desk because uh, I, I, I pretty much use the knife case for ones with pocket clips because it's easier. Um, okay, guys, that's Uncle Cow's knife collection. Uh, hope you all enjoyed. Stay tuned, stay safe, and 
Like I would say, don't do anything I wouldn't do.